Uh, how has the season gone so far? You? Well, I think for both me and the team, it's been up and down. As a team, you, you want to win every game. So I feel like we've been playing uh, a more solid game uh, lately. And uh, right now, I feel it's just um, a little scoring efficiency that's that's missing. And that, I mean, we're, we're working on it every day. For me, um, I think it's been, uh, I've had quite good games, I feel like. Um, I know it's been a been a step for me to be a more more offensive player than I've been the last couple of years in in Russia. But uh, um, I'm you know I'm I'm enjoying playing offensive and offensive hockey, and uh, feel like I'm I've been been growing um, every game 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 I'm playing so far. How difficult has it been to get used? to the rhythm of the Finnish league games compared to previous leagues? Uh, I think it's been okay. Um, somewhat similar in, in any league, you know, and if you look at the USA, the rinks are smaller and in Russia it's 50-50 how the rink is going to be and here it's it's a little different too. Um, but I think, you know, you can, I only try to focus on, on my own game and and I, th I think it's it's been, it's been okay. As a line player on a power play, how quickly do you have to make decisions about shooting or passing the puck, and how much do your power play line practice? Well, we we usually practice, you know, every week, um, and uh, obviously we've been been struggling so far this this season. But uh, you know, it's been a little different players on on and off the the, the power play. So, um, but I think we're you know we we're working every week on on the chemistry and then try to find the. The solution that we need to to start scoring in, in power play. You know, nowadays the the team's PKers are are so good at being in the shooting lane or passing lane. So you need to you need to be quick and, and make a decision quick. How important do you think it is that you get to play in your local junior team before you move to the juniors of a bigger club? Well, I think it's it's uh, really important to have those. Uh, Smaller clubs in in, in the country, um, you know, I think it gives uh, uh, a better chance for for more kids to to play hockey and to um, you know enjoy the game. When I was young, you know, we played soccer in the summer and, and hockey in the winter, and uh, you know, you just enjoyed it and had fun with it because I, you know. If you're gonna play hockey for, for the, the rest of your life, you know you still have 15, 20 years to to work hard and you know to be a professional. But but when you're young, I think it's it's a big key to just be able to enjoy it and, and you know have fun and, and play hockey because it's fun. Um, so I think that's that's why we need those small clubs. Uh, how well have you gotten used to all as a city? Um, I like Olo. Um, I, I feel like it's it's kind of similar to to Schleftio. Um, You know, it's not the the biggest city, but I kind of kind of like that. I'm more of a a small town person than a than a big city. A lot of relaxing. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's a lot of you know we travel a lot, so when you come home, you're kind of tired, and then you have a game the next day, so it's you know you kind of want to save the energy to be ready to, to play games. And we got a few Swedes on this team. How much time do you spend with the other Swedes on the team? Well, I mean, we see each other every day pretty much. Um, but usually we, we you know go for lunch after practice and, and that's about it. And then sometimes if we have a day off, we can do some, go out to eat or, or something like that. Thank you so much. All right, perfect. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you.